Trespass in this garden, treat it like no other Cause we engage and we inspire, we unite our borough It's time for come ups, we're at step 7, rise above us So on our back there's a target man, it's time for Bubba And you can't trespass in this garden, treat it like no other Cause we engage and we inspire, we unite our borough It's time for come ups, we're at step 7, rise above us So on our back there's a target man, it's time for Bubba If Rash is one and one, you know he's beating the defenders Four up in the back, we got a team full of Avengers Benji's at the wheel and that's the reason for progression This is season 6, season 6, the season for success Yes people, this is Limor TV and today we're back with Cup Action, Game Week 22, Essex Alliance Senior Division Cup first round against Blue Marlin at home. The boys looking to get a good solid cup run together, the road to Leighton Orient begins here and Limor getting us underway from right to left, we're actually running up the left hand side to try to fire one in but Blue Marlin have tried to get it away but it's been picked up by Alex, he's got time on the ball. He's tried to put one in, but that's gone straight to the keeper. And this is actually the last remaining cup competition that the boys are in. So we're going to go all out, make sure that we put Blue Marl into the sword, get ourselves into the next round. The keeper's cleared it up the pitch. It's gone high rather than far, but it's been picked up by George, who finds Gracia on this left-hand side, who gives it to Ty. Ty's getting his head up, drops the shoulder, gives it to George. Who finds Yinka? Ty's made a good run. Yinka's tried to find him on that left hand side. He's just been bundled over. Three minutes in now. Blue Marlin with their first attack of the game. Richie's covering well. Richie's just standing him up over there in the corner. He gets past him, but Richie gets him at the second attempt. He's composed. He's found Dylan with an excellent flick. And the ball's just come to the middle of the park. It's a bit scrappy at the moment. Both sides still finding each other out. And Yinka's played it to Ty. Tries to get past the defender. He's just been chopped. Absolutely taken out. Four minutes on the clock. George with a free kick. Keepers come. It's unconvincing. It's on the edge of the box. Blue Marlin looks to get it clear. Can they build a break themselves? That's a good ball. Alex just can't quite intercept it. He's running into the channel now. He's got his head up. It's stayed on. Or has it? No, the referee's given a goal kick. There's a let off for Limor. Good break from Blue Marlin. Eight minutes on the clock now. Ball's over on that right hand side. And Suma's running through. Breaking from the back. He's got into the edge of the box. He's pulled it back. The defender's cleared it. It's come to Rio, who slaps it into the bottom corner. And it's Limor Gardens 1, Blue Marlin 0. Can we get a replay? A gut-busting run from centre-back. He pulls it back. It comes to Rio, slaps it first time with his left foot. And it's Limor Gardens 1, Blue Marlin 0. And the boys take the lead after a bit of a scrappy start. Ten minutes on the clock now. Blue Marlin are going to do everything they can to get back into the game. It's cup football. And that was good strength by Josh. He's looked to play it through, but he's offside. Blue Marlin have got it in their own half. Just trying to pick passes that they can't. And that was a good turn by George. Plays it out on the right-hand side to Dylan. Who looks to beat his defender. He's got past one. He's looked to have a shot with his right. I tell you what, it's a good effort. The keeper was worried. It's actually gone from a corner. And Dylan's whipped it in. The keeper's punched it away. It's a good period of pressure from Limor. Really building the momentum. And Blue Marlin just can't get it away. It's come to tie. He's had a shot. The keeper's saved it. 15 minutes on the clock now. Blue Marlin with a free kick. It's gone straight into my hands. And Blue Marlin have got it on the left-hand side. It just can't really get out. And that's good play. It's with Ty. He drops his shoulder. Plays it with the outside of his right foot. Grazia, can he keep it in? He's just fallen over at the wrong time. There's 40 minutes on the clock now. Suma with a long ball. Linesman looked like he was going to flag, but he didn't. It's a bit scrappy again, but that's good hustling. Won the ball back. Good strength. Alex, can he keep it ticking? 
He hasn't. He's lost possession. And Blue Marlin can hit us on the break again. Suma's coming back at him. Richie with a great tackle. The follow-up challenge. The referees penalised him for it. And it's a penalty to Blue Marlin. A chance to get themselves right back into the game. And he's slotted it into the bottom corner. Sends me the wrong way. Can we get a replay? Composed penalty. Sends me the wrong way. Puts it into the side net in. And it's Limor Gardens 1. Blue Marlin 1. We're going to go into half-time level. Having dominated a fairly scrappy game. It's frustrating. But the boys need to regroup. Go again. Or can we take the lead before half-time? That's a good turn from Rio. Plays it into Ty. Ty puts it out on this left-hand side to Alex. Who opens it up for Yinker on the overlap. He beats his man. He's got to the byline. He just can't quite get a good cross. A good connection. It's gone behind for a goal kick. Three minutes into stoppage time now in the first half. It's been flicked on. I've come out. Look to get it clear. And Blue Marlin have got it on this left-hand side. Soom has picked it up. He's dropped the shoulder. But the referee has blown for half-time. It's Limor Gardens 1. Blue Marlin 1. Let's see what the gaffer made in the first 45 minutes. Whenever they're hot, we need to burn out their hot streak. Because right now, every time we're getting on the ball, we're fucking giving it back to them straight away. We've got fucking Jordan throwing it, his body in and out of every fucking challenge. We've got Ben doing the same thing. Richie doing the same thing. That's why we gave away the penalty. They're in the relegation zone. We're in two different aspects of stuff. So them looking up to us, they want this more than us right now, boys. We need to be in this game a lot more and be focused, yeah? From looking after the ball, from supporting your players, from talking, those little talks, saying, oh, there's a man on your left shoulder, or, oh, I'm gonna run through, I'm on your left shoulder, whatever. All of these things make us better. But right now, we look, we're very equal. And that's because we're not doing the basics. Ty, George, you both can play. Get on it, yeah? But make it tick. And it's Limor getting us underway for the second half. You know the boys are frustrated. We know that we can do better. We know that we are better and we need to be better if we want to put our names into the hat for the next round. And Blue Marlin have got the ball with their left back. That's a good shot. Good turn actually. And it's a good ball. Decent little period straight after half time. They've looked to play it through. It's come straight to me. Blue Marlin take the corner short. Are they going to get it whipped in? They have done. It's been cleared, but only as far as the striker is at a shot. It's hit Richie. And the referee is given a penalty. Handball against Richie. It's harsh. It's definitely harsh. But Blue Marlin have got a huge opportunity to take the lead in a cup game where they just haven't really been at the races. And he steps up and he's put it straight down the middle. It's now Blue Marlin 2, Limor Gardens 1. Can we get a replay? He just steps up. He's already scored one. He's gone straight down the middle for the second one. And it's now Blue Marlin 2. Limor Gardens 1. The boy is really up against it now. We know that we've got more than enough in the tank to score two or three goals and really put this game to bed. I guess the good thing is we've got 45 minutes to make stuff happen. And that's a big header by Suma. It's just broke to Rio in the middle. He's still got it. He's looked for the run of Rashford. He's one-on-one -on -one with a goalie. Run the instrumental. You know how that story finishes. It's Limor Gardens 2, Blue Marlin 2. The boys hit back immediately. Can we get a replay? His excellent strength by Rio. Great ball into Rashford, who's a mile on side. He's running one-on-one -on -one with a goalkeeper. Slots it into the bottom corner. And it's Limor Gardens 2, Blue Marlin 2. There's an excellent response from Limor. We were behind for less than a few minutes. Can we go on and get the winner? Just as I say that, Blue Marlin have a shot from range, but it's straight at me. There's nearly an hour on the clock now. They've gone route one. A long ball. I've come out. Look for a tie, I believe. And it's Blue Marlin on the break again. Their clearance has been fumbled. They've had another shot, but he's skied it. That was a huge let off for Limore. Nearly let Blue Marlin back in the lead. Now 70 minutes on the clock. That's gone out, surely. Referee's playing on. And George just can't quite find anyone, but he's got it back. 
and that's an excellent ball where one on one the defender's coming back he's done a good job just to hold him off 79 minutes on the clock now the boy's really pushing for that winner and that's a good cross in well held by the keeper five minutes left the normal time this will go straight to penalties and it's blue marlin they're through they've had a shot i've saved it i've gathered it again at the second attempt again huge let off five minutes left you don't want to be conceding now and i find eman who looks for the runner dylan dylan's through the defenders tried to hack at him he's gonna cut in is he gonna shoot he has this good clearance from the defender great covering tackle I thought that was the moment and Blue Marlin looked to just bring it out now. Need a huge, huge effort from the boys to make sure that we win and that's little John getting in there, putting his body on the line and ball's gone out for a throw on which has been fired in, it's been cleared at the front post. A bit of head tennis there, Zizou plays it out to Richie. He gets his head up, he's fired it in. We can't quite bring it down. The referee's blown for offside anyway, it wouldn't have counted. It's been a frantic last few minutes. And Blue Marlin now on the break. Can they get themselves a, a winner? And that's good clearance from Lymore. And that's John who's picked it up. He's played it through to Grazia. The defenders slid Grazia's through one on one. Can he wrap it up? He can, he slots it through the keeper's legs. It's Lymore Gardens three, Blue Marlin two, and the boys have taken the lead in this cup game. You can see it means a lot to us, running over to Grazia. Can we get a replay? Big John picked it up, played it into Grazia. The defender tried to clear it. He gets past Grazia, and once Grazia gets going, no one's catching him. I don't care who you are. And can he finish? Of course he can. And it's Lymore Gardens three, Blue Marlin two, we're into the final minute of time added on now. Blue Marlin with a free kick. They're going to launch it into the box. And that's been well cleared. It's come out to Dylan. Dylan holds it up well. He plays it into a good space. Five minutes into stoppage time now. Surely this is the last piece of action of the game. And Blue Marlin are on the attack. It's good heroic defending from Lymore. Eman gets his foot in the way. They're going to have a shot. It's come straight to me. And surely that's all she wrote. I play it out on this left hand side. Then the referee has blown for full time. And it has finished Lymore Gardens 3. Blue Marlin 2. The boys have put their name into the hat for the next round. Boys, quickly, quick summary of today. And I'm not going to lie, we made things very hard. But at the same time, we pull out what we do and what we do best. Saying that, we did that against Parisi and in the next round we got knocked out straight away. We've got to take these games serious. Like I said, everyone's up for beating us, isn't it? So we need to make sure that we're out here. We just deal with teams every week on point. Does that make sense? And there you have it. It's finished Lymore Gardens 3, Blue Marlin 2, goals from Rio, Rashford and Grazia, assists from Suma, Rio and Little John. Man of the match goes to Jorginho, solid in the middle of the park. And the boys are through to the next round where we will face Chigwell Town. And make sure you tune in next week. It's the return fixture against Chadwell Heath Spartans away from home. This is Lymore TV. Some can, some can't. If Rio is the acid, Zizou is the alkaline And you ain't breaching our defence, I told you countless times Cause we got Tomo in the sticks, it's like a county line We always try to make a statement on or off the pitch Helping people into work, but still we got a lot to give We're just a band of brothers, Donny Osman shit We're really changing lives through football when you clock this shit you can't trespass in this garden, treat it like no other Cause we engage and we inspire, we unite our borough It's time for come ups, we're at step 7, rise above us So on our back there's a target man, it's time for bubba And you can't trespass in this garden, treat it like no other